So we got scanned by this here is what happened. I noticed the tire was going low, so I went to a tire shop and he marked it here that's leaking from here. And he says um, I need to get it vulcanized because since it's on this corner here, they can't really patch it like there. So I went to the vulcanization shop and he peeled it open there and stuck light in there. And he says these tires are worn out very worn out says so that's what happened you have to get another tire because they're very old we are off to the tire shop Here we are, we're at the tire shop. Right across the street there is the Merida Zoo, El Centenario. Make sure you check out, I got videos from there. And here's the combi van, waiting for its turn at Servillantas. You can put new tires in the front. The back tires, I had changed already. A couple of weeks ago, I put new tires in the back. And these front ones need to be changed. I took my spare rock because the other tire was going flat. And I put my spare tire right there. So that's gonna go back on the front. I've got get two brand new tires in the front. Then we got four brand new tires that match. So the guy who sold us this van, we checked the tires and they had good tires on it and it turns out when we went and to close off the deal and pay him and all that looks like before we did that he changed the tires and he put us some old ones as uh, you can see right here check this out so guy tire shop showed me how to tell about the tires you have this here, this here, 27. Can you see it there, 27? That's the week the tire was produced. And 07, that's the year the tire was made. So this tire was made in 2007. It is now 2024. That tells you everything you need to know. This is an old tire. And the guy says the it's just you know when he shined the light in here and checked it it's just not structurally sound anymore so we got scanned by the guy who sold us the van he switched the tires on us at the last moment and he gave us old tires So he scammed us, put down old tires. Yeah, that was a good scam because it cost 3,800 for two and I'm buying four. So he made close to 8,000 pesos off of our head. Crooked bastard. But you know, bad will happen to him. He will have bad luck in life. Because when you do bad to others, bad will happen. 
to you always does especially when you do bad to me God will put you back I've had people do bad to me and, and they've always just come back hit them really really hard so he shouldn't have done something like that that's not nice to do but you know he lived he learned and with brand new tires it'll be good it will be a lot safer on the road so I'll show you when they start working on it so the guy is gonna all down there I just put just about went down take out the rim for the guy aquí está el rim para uno de los llantas aquí va a estar en este y este y ese otro allá va a ser el refacción de enfrente el tapón This one he got the hubcaps off already. This one he is going back on the spare. That's gotta go on the spare here on the front. Where it puts the tubaburo to knock down the donkey. And they inflate them with nitrogen. Damn. Something really slippery here, and I just about went down the second time now. So these are my new tires here. I think, I think these are mine. Oh, my tires are over there. Oh yeah, my tires are over here already. Let me show you how the guy mounts them onto the rim. This is our high-tech stuff here. Like okay, I got the wheel balancer. I'll computerize everything. Put the tire on and off. All fancy modern modern equipment from North America. Easy and fast to do. Place where I went when I was changing it, when I thought I just needed a patch. It was like really old school. Like I had crowbars and crap to crap to do it here. Quick and simple. Very quick and simple. Pump it up. Así le ponen nitro, nitrógeno. ¿Cuánto libro se lleva una llanta así? 50. 50? So it takes 50 pounds of nitrogen. Y eso está bueno para meses para que sale, ¿no? El nitrógeno no sale tan rápido como aire normal. Okay. So the nitrogen is because then um, it leaks a lot slower and then you only have to check your tires every month or so. First time I've ever been ever put nitrogen into any of my vehicles. So I hope it's good. Look at a huge property here, look at that. Wow. tire off the rim. I gotta keep this old rubber for emergency for my spare. I'm not gonna throw it away. The other one I'm gonna throw away because it's got a crack in it so I don't need it anymore. We're gonna start they're gonna start balancing this one. Uh, right there he's getting the old tire it's gonna come off the rim. 
this is the new tire that's going to be balanced everything computerized very modern 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 not like the olden days i remember the olden days you know when you go to a tire shop and they'd be slammed it with sledgehammers and crazy stuff now no, it's modern it's fast it's quick it's easy This is the tire balancing. It's para balancear, no? Sí. Tire balancing process. All computerized. I really don't understand much about it, but they know what they're doing. Then they put in the. I think it's lead weights. That way, there's no little wobble or nothing like that. Guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, leave me a comment, and share the video. Comments, I need a lot of comments because um, my subscriber is going pretty good, but my comments is still going very slow. See, he circulated it and it said zero, 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 zero. Everything balanced out perfectly before it had a one, two, five, or something like that. Now it's zero. Good balance. You always need good tires on a vehicle. Very important. And here it's Serviantas in Merida, right across the street from the zoo. This is the place to go. I got the back tires topped up too front brand new tires nitrogen I have the spare right here and um, I'm gonna hook that up when I get to the house not right now that's where I get out of their way so everything is good the other brand new tire is here Check it out. Yeah, very happy. Happy customer. Let me go lose some money now. Well, that's it, guys. 3,809 pesos. But I got brand new tires. I'm good to go for a long, long time. I don't have to worry about flats and that. I'm gonna hook up the spare when I get home. Not gonna do it here because look, there's cars waiting for the turn. So see you guys later in the next video. I'm in Merida, Yucatan right now. Until next time, bye bye.